Eastern Connecticut is underway tonight. Thanks to the generosity of many who've donated time and money, thousands of kids will have presents under their Christmas tree. News 8's Tina Detell takes us behind the scenes. Three-year-old boy, eight-year-old girl, 12-year-old boy. It's distribution day at the Bulletin in Norwich, but we're not talking newspapers. This is the annual toy drive, the Tommy Toy Fund. This is nice and, and helpful too. It helps a lot. Cheryl Lee Santiago is among 5,000 families who have signed up to receive a bag full of gifts this year. She has a four-year-old daughter. I'm not working at this time, and it's really hard. I only have one child, but I don't know. I want to give her the best. <laughs> It's not easy sometimes. They're for little babies, they got a little disc that come in with them. Each child is given age appropriate gifts. Everything from basketballs for boys and play sets for younger kids. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. Each family also gets one of these games, and each child gets a pair of gloves. Now, the Bulletin has been involved with the Tommy Toy Fund since 1973. That's after a little girl wrote a letter to the editor saying that her mother didn't have enough money to buy Christmas presents and her younger brother Tommy was too young to understand. An act of kindness which has flourished over the years. It now takes as much as sixty-five to seventy thousand dollars and help from organizations like the United Way all donations. It's donations of toys, donations of money, and fundraisers. She is going to be excited. Santiago wasn't expecting so many presents. Gifts can be picked up through Friday in Danielson, New London, and here in Norwich. Thank you guys very much and Merry Christmas to you. Tina Detell, News 8.